guys, welcome to another episode of Tea Time with Maya. I'm Maya, and today we are going to do an unboxing. Um, and so I already know what it looks like um, because I work at Williams Sonoma, but um, I thought I would show you guys basically me opening it for the first time and knowing it's mine instead of seeing it and um, admiring it from afar. So, um, it is, you'll see from the title, it is the, uh, it is the infuser teapot. Um, and so it is, uh, it brews your little loose teas. Um, and it's made with like a little classic pot. Um, it's clear glass and it's something that I haven't, I haven't been looking at Williams Sonoma's for a long time, but I've been wanting a glass tea pot for a long time because I feel like every time I make tea for um, uh, Tea Time with Maya, I want it to look really like professional and really pretty. And um, I just have my little glass cup, and so I've been wanting to like kind of mix things up a bit. And um, I saw a glass tea kettle on Amazon, but one of the things I was most worried about was when it gets to me, is it still going to be whole? Um, and because I wasn't able to answer that and be like, yes, I know for sure it's going to get here whole, I was like, let me find someplace else that does it. And then a week, a week into looking, I found out that we at William Sonoma sold one and I picked it up and I kind of looked at it from the outside of the box and I was like, you know, I need this. Um, <laughs> and um, if you are a person that works at any of the William Sonoma chains, you know that as an employee, you get an employee discount and that discount just so happens to be 40%. So it's one price for everyone else and then for if you're an employee. So I was like, I don't have enough reasons why I shouldn't buy it, so I'm gonna get it. <laughs> and so the back of it just gives a little quick on what it is and a little bit about it. I'm just gonna read it to you guys. Um, it says that it brews and serves your favorite loose teas with our classic pot pot made out of clear glass that showcases the natural tea's color. Um, the removable stainless steel mesh drainer allows tea leaves to fully infuse the brew. And then it says a tight fitting lid helps keep your tea at perfect sipping temperature while the angled spout ensures neat, precise pouring. And the capacity of this tea kettle is 18.5 ounces and it says it's ideal for steeping tea or infusing water, hot or cold, teapot and basket, dishwasher, dishwasher safe, and you're supposed to hand wash the lid. Lid. The lid. Um, and another thing is mom and I, for conversations with Karen and Maya, did a list of 12 of our favorite things. Um, no, uh, 24 of our favorite things, and we both did 12 each. And one of my 12 was this teapot. And I joke in the video that I'm gonna go buy it today. And I would like to tell the viewers that watch both, I did buy it that day. <laughs> I'm, but I haven't done the unboxing because of school and stuff. So we're just gonna open it now. I'm just gonna open it now. So it just has a little, little guy, pull it. And it comes to the top and it comes in this is as far as i got i wanted to make sure i had all the pieces okay so it has this little dude on the top and it's because the top is made out of this um i don't know how to describe the material but it's hard but it can scratch so i'm guessing that's why they did not put it with the glass so it's this guy sorry i'm so proud of my little purchase um <laughs> It's this, and here's what I'm saying, like, yeah, it, yeah, that's that. This is not ASMR, I'm just trying to show you the density of this thing. Um, and then, and this part comes up, and let me just put it down. Out to 
touching pieces. This is the little infuser, guys. Oh, sorry. <laughs> this is the infuser. They did this really well. This thing was not coming apart, and they were sure about that. Okay. Little cardboard. Okay. Pop it to the side. And um, the thing, the other thing that I liked about it is the infuser um, lid does not have to stay in the tea kettle. If you are, say, washing it, you can still drink your tea without this guy being in there. Um, but because the thing does go with it, it's not like a mulling ball. It won't move around in the tea kettle is what the understanding was. And I didn't want it to move because it's glass and I realized that if I had a mulling ball in there, it could hit one side and then crash. Um, <laughs> This is the little teacup. Tea kettle, not teacup. It's so cute! I'm going to be. You guys are going to be sick of me. You're just going to be sick of me. So I'm just going to put this in here. And it has like. It's not a suction, but it kind of like. There was like some. Um, resistance when you put it down. Oops, and now it's back up. Oh, these little guys, they hook to the lid to make sure that it stays in and doesn't pop back up. And then if I hit it again, it just comes back up. And the top. Then you just pour like so. I think next week's video, I'm going to put something in it and show you guys that. But it is so cute, guys. It's a little smaller than I thought it was going to be, like, um, in looks. But it does still hold 18... What was it? 18.5 ounces so it still holds what i need it to hold i don't know why i thought that was going to be bigger um but this is this and on the bottom it says williams and sonoma so it's cute yeah i do realize that i got paid and then i put it back in the company i do realize this but <laughs> it's really cute but um i hope you guys enjoyed today's video um, if you guys have any ideas on what I should do with it, or if you have one yourself and you can tell me what you use yours for. How much was it? Oh, good point, good point, good point. It was $39.95. Um, I got it on employee discount, so, um, it was 20 something for me, but <laughs> it is a pretty good deal for what it is. Um, and the fact that if you buy it at your William Sonoma store, you're one supporting the store, but also you are you have a guarantee that when you get it, that if it's broken, you can return it, which was the thing that I was worried about about a glass tea kettle. But um, yeah, mom's behind the camera. If anyone knows, <laughs> but, but um, you can return it. Um, the return policy as a person that works there is 30 days. So if you get a little. Um, um, William Sonoma tea kettle or anything from William Sonoma and you have not used it and you it arrives and there's a piece missing or something's wrong with it you can return it back to your store even if you bought it online 30 days and they will give you your money back so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video please like share subscribe and press the bell for notifications bye guys